And tonight, a young man is dead after a triple shooting near Old Dominion University. Norfolk police say 20-year-old Davrion King died today. They found him badly hurt on Killam Avenue this weekend. Emily Harrison spoke with a witness about the violence that happened steps away from his home. Ty Drenning says he opened his window to find people flooding into his backyard trying to hide on his porch from the shooting that sent two people to the hospital and killed one man. Like 12, 12 shots, probably 12 to 15 shots went off. Norfolk police say 20 year old Davrian King died from his injuries after medics took him to the hospital with life threatening injuries. First responders also treated one woman at the scene for a bullet that grazed her and took another 21 year old man to the hospital for a serious gunshot injury. Looking out my window, I could see like a girl and a dude right here uh, on the sidewalk. Days later, Norfolk police are still looking for answers, going door to door and asking neighbors what they saw or heard Sunday night. So far, Norfolk police have not released any information about a possible suspect or any arrests. Um, just buffoonery. There's nothing but ignoramus to the fullest right now. Neighbors like Andrew Hun say they are frustrated by all the violence that has happened on Killam Street. This triple shooting comes eight months after a shooting killed two people and injured five on the same street. We got to clean it up. They've done zero since that national mass shooting on this block, which was literally a thousand feet from where we're standing right now since. In Norfolk, I'm Emily Harrison, 13 News Now. Despite how close the shooting is to Old Dominion University, a spokesman tells us that none of their students is involved. However, they will be increasing their police patrols in the area for the foreseeable future.